My name is Nathaniel Drew. And I'm Johnny Harris. And we've developed this course to share everything that we've learned from our combined experiences traveling and telling the stories of those travels. Hey, it's Peter. Today, I'm gonna to review Nathaniel Drew and Johnny Harris's visual storytelling course. I'm gonna cover what you can expect to learn, the pros and cons, and is it worth it? First, what can you expect from the course? Nathaniel Drew and Johnny Harris are two of the best travel filmmakers in the world, and they basically teamed up to share everything they know about travel filmmaking. By the end of the course, you'll be able to make amazing travel videos. You'll learn what storytelling is. Hint, it's not the traditional three-act structure. You'll learn which gear to get, ingredients of a good story, how to plan and script out your story before you hit the road, shoot and get all the shots you need, edit and put it all together. <laughs> Two, pros and cons. The biggest pro is that you'll gain confidence that you can make amazing travel videos. When you hear directly from Nathaniel and Johnny and you see how they do it, you start building confidence that you're able to do it yourself. Second, you'll get world-class tools to make awesome travel videos. From storytelling principles, what gear to get, how to handle pre-production, production, post-production, post you're basically watching the world's best do it and explain why and how they do it. And so you'll be able to have those tools to do it yourself. I've always been in awe of Nathaniel's stories, how meaningful and nuanced they are, and how I just could never understand how he puts it all together. And now that I've seen him build the A-roll and layer on his special sauce with the music and footage and sound effects, now I have some of those tools to be able to tell those stories. Third, you'll save a ton of time and energy because they teach you what to focus on what really matters in a good travel story so that when you're planning, when you're on the ground, you're not just running around like a headless chicken shooting everything and letting your camera roll constantly. You'll be able to know, okay, I need a wide shot, medium, close up human action. For what you get encouragement, when Nathaniel talks about how creativity, his process is so iterative that he has so many versions that a lot of the times he has no idea what he's doing at the start or even during or even while he's editing, he follows his systems and he trusts the process and that it always works out in the end. The last big one I'll mention is originality. Because there's two teachers teaching two different methodologies, it really shows you that storytelling is unique and personal to you, forces you to find your own voice versus following a prescribed template. And if you're enjoying this video so far and wanna see more creator videos, definitely hit subscribe. Let's talk about cons. Nathaniel and Johnny do an awesome job about talking about how to build tension in the hook and how to resolve it in the middle. And they talk about forward motion and visual evidence, but they don't really cover how do you structure the middle of a story? Second, a few parts are a bit confusing. For example, they talk about three levels of storytelling, linear storytelling, and then non-linear storytelling, and then deeper meaning. But two and three seem kind of similar to me. Um, so that's just an example. Third, two teachers can be confusing at times because if they're teaching two different ways to do things, it's uh, hard to know which way to go yourself. Having said that, I'm glad both of them are teaching their styles. It's almost like you get a two in one course. Fourth, there's no homework or feedback. I wish there was more application of the theory that they're teaching and just feedback so that you can improve. Um, having said that though, I definitely leaned heavily on this course before I traveled on the Camino de Santiago and during and after. So it is a great reference manual. So just keep in mind, it's a one-way online video course. Fifth, I wish there was some sort of community of travel filmmakers or Bright Trip students. I think that would take this course to the next level. This is a generic comment for any one-way video course. Lastly, the website has a few user experience bugs. For example, it'll freeze on mobile once in a while and the captions are default on sometimes. The content's so good that it's not a big deal, but that's something I hope they improve in the future. The moment of truth. Is it worth it? Visual storytelling is $225 which is a big chunk of change. This course is not for you if you're not into travel filmmaking or travel vlogging. If you wanna learn general storytelling, I would suggest learning the basic three act storytelling structure first. This course is 100% for you if you're into travel filmmaking, travel vlogging, if you're a beginner or you're advanced and you just wanna improve your travel videos and you wanna make awesome stuff like Nathaniel and Johnny, this course is perfect for you. I can't think of a better travel filmmaking course I feel so lucky to be alive. If you want to learn about my takeaways and learning from the course, check out this video. And if you want to improve your YouTube videos on your channel, check out my review of Matt Devella's Master YouTube course. Happy traveling.